Volvo Cars and Swedish power generation giants Vattenfall are together developing a plug-in hybrid that can run on renewable, climate-neutral electricity for only €3 Euros per 100 kilometres. Just one-third of the cost compared to a diesel engine. The new plug-in hybrid that can be charged from a completely standard wall socket should be on the market in 2012. We will be one of the first premium car companies to have a plug-in hybrid. It's an association with an energy company that's got the ability to actually supply the power that goes into the vehicle and powers it. The basic thing is that by electrifying the car fleet around Europe, the demand for electricity will grow and of course we will have the pleasure of delivering clean electricity to all these cars. The new plug-in hybrid will be able to be driven up to 50 kilometers on a single charge which means that most car owners will be able to drive to and from work without the need to recharge. If it's a question of longer journeys, then the extremely economical diesel engine can be used. This engine will also have an exceptionally low fuel consumption of under 2 litres per 100 kilometres. The consumption is very, very low and an electrical engine and a battery is a very efficient way to propulse a vehicle and uh, this is about one third of the uh, cost or compared to a normal diesel car. Volvo Cars are now forming a joint company together with Vattenfall to develop this technique, where one of the major advantages is the fact that the car can be charged from a standard wall socket. We're, we're really enthusiastic about what we're doing. This will take Vattenfall and take automotive sector to the next level. Electrification in vehicles is, because it's new, in its early stages is still very expensive to do. In this way, two parties can actually share that R&D expense and I think get there more efficiently and quicker. But many people are asking themselves whether or not Vattenfall can guarantee that it is green electricity that the car will be charged with. In general, the, the energy production system will be more or less emission free in the long term. When we talk about a little shorter term, we have already hydropower, we have renewables, we have nuclear power, and we are working seriously with reducing the emissions from the fossil fuel power plants. We promise to, to reduce it to half until 2030. The initial purchase price for these cars will be somewhat higher due to the expense of the lithium batteries. But several leading energy experts state that the major environmental gains and extremely low running costs will compensate for this. In the future our only resources available are renewable uh, and uh, electricity will be a very important one of them. And what Volvo is doing now, uh, building plug-in hybrids that are plugged in and charged with electricity is the, the right way to go. This is the kind of vehicle we need to have in the future. Electric vehicles are superior in urban situations where the conventional engine's emissions have serious health effects. And also electricity is easy to produce by renewable sources of energy so in the global context. It can also be an important step towards sustainability and reduction of climate change threats. At the present time, Vattenfall are working to develop a new infrastructure and to produce tomorrow's solutions for charge stations and payment, so that motorists can simply charge up with electricity in public places. Uh, basically, if we took all the cars in Sweden and made them electric, uh, the energy consumption or the electricity consumption would increase 6% approximately. This means that this margin is already uh, here, we already have that margin in our electricity production system. We are very pleased to work with uh, and cooperate with Vattenfall. It's a very strong company. They have the same ambition and vision as we have, and they will help us to uh, develop the uh, infrastructure with the uh, charging stations, with the building systems, and how we can charge uh, the batteries quicker than, than we do today. It's a very strong and good cooperation. Volvo has consciously chosen to develop this project with existing car models which will also mean that these will be the world's safest plug-in hybrids. We think this is exactly the right way to go for the future. This is how people will drive and buy cars in the future with clean emissions, uh, very low consumptions and still a safe, practical and very modern car with nice drive and handling. The aim for the series production of plug-in hybrids and the new infrastructure will generate many new employment opportunities 
so that Sweden will continue to be on the very cutting edge of advanced environmental technology. The Swedish government uh, has the ambition to be a testing ground for new technologies in the transport sector. We have been leading in the uh, utilization of biofuels in, in, in Europe and we will be a country where new electric vehicles and other vehicle technologies will be tested and the consumers will have the opportunity to test them and give feedback to the producers. A Vattenfall's strategy is making electricity clean. That means that we will only invest in renewables, in nuclear and clean coal. And of course this will make electricity clean, which means that we will actually contribute or be the real concrete things in delivering the sustainable society, protecting the climate. For Volvo to come out with a plug-in, a real plug-in hybrid uh, in 2012 will put us at the leading edge of uh, electrification.